Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel for another game of Blood Bowl 3. As we uh, continue playing on with the Mordheim Undertakers, the Necromantic Horror Team. And it feels like we are playing another undead team. The actual shambling undead team, because I can see a few mummies. So, it's a dead versus dead game. But a slightly different variation of dead. We're more the squelchy undead. And, uh, yeah, our oppositions are... Have a few more skeletons and... Uh, mummies, no doubt. Well, possibly not the skeletons. Let's have a look. Two mummies, four ghouls, two whites, a load of zombies. Yeah. So I suppose technically the whites are skeletons, aren't they? A form of skeleton. Right, so they've got a fan factor of seven like we have. No journeyman. Let's have a look at what we're up against. It's an undead team that started very well. Five victories, one draw, one defeat. And they're burning through um, gold division. So they're coming up fast. So what have we got? We've got a mummy with block. We've got a white with guard. Another white with mighty blow tackle. And a ghoul, a plodging ghoul with sure hands. That's it. So it's a pretty decent team. How many ghouls is that? I thought I saw quite a few. Yeah, there's three of the ghouls as well. So it's a decent team. And we're waiting for them to uh, decide on the inducements, I think. Oh, no, we're not. They're <laughs> waiting for us. Sorry. They get 20,000, so that will probably be an assistant coach. Right. It's the coin toss. And we will... Choose and we will receive. And we'll see how they're going to want to set up. Are they going to go strong line? Because mummies are pretty hard to take down. Uh, I've forgotten what we've got. Oh, we have got a guard wraith. We've got our bludging werewolves. We've got our bludge step ghoul. And we've only got one block flesh column now because the mean old chaos chosen team we played last killed one of my, um, well, no. Badly injured a flesh golem, so they had a strength reduction, and no one wants a strength three flesh golem. Not at the cost that they are. So they're serving us up the zombies. Smart. But they're giving us a pop at the uh, at the ghouls. Right, so um, my newly christened flesh golem. Well, I don't know if I want to block with him. Could do with getting rid of that wraith. That mm. yeah, we could use the werewolf for that. Where's my see the other mighty blows over there? Okay, so you'll be able to take him. I think I won't. Have we got him any more blocks? We haven't. So we do want you to block. We'll pop you there. And we'll need another zombie for put you there for now. In fact, if I'm not going to use another block type, I want to get rid of that guard white and him. Might want to get rid of him more. go with that for now in fact let's just swap you round we're not going to need you to be there so I'll bring you into here instead okay all right what am I doing wrong have I got too many players two four six, eight ten I've got a player somewhere are we down to eleven players oh someone's probably injured oh they are we've got some injured zombies Oh, in that case, we will put you there. Okay. Sorry, that setup took me far too long to sort out. Oh, and the assistant coach's trigger. But we get it anyway. Because we rolled really well. Brilliant. Okay, the ball is there, though. So, 
Let's start by getting a zombie to cover. And then... We're going to go this way. I think we're going to have to block and block again because I might actually. Mm. No, we won't do that. Um, so we'll just take you as well. Good, down you go. We will follow that up. Nice. And that's a player off the pitch. Right, those two are dodgy. What do I want you to do? See, we could take a swing at him. Or we could go around the back. I think I like that. A rush. No way. Well... It's going to be a rush either way. All right, let's move you up, as I don't think we're going around the back of there. We will do this now. Okay, so that's a push, and we will push you forwards to there. Bring you one in there. So they get two assists, but we get three. So I actually think. Would that be two die? Or is that would be two die up? So I think we're going to do that. And hopefully push forward one. Yes. Very good. Cool. Then you're going to come to there. You're going to come to there. i get you in there. And then you're going to pick up the ball. First time. He does as well. Uh, we'll pop in there. And sorry, long turn done. I've totally left that wraith open, but I'm hoping some foul appearance or block might help him. The key is, don't get overexcited and try and break away his score, because I think we're already a player up. We can do some damage. Is he going to follow up into... No, he's not. And the werewolf's fine. Good. We could do with killing him. He's possibly... the biggest threat. Well, that was useful, wasn't it? Um, no, we don't want to go further back. Taken out by a ghoul. Mr. White. All right then. So we're going to bring you into there. You are going to come into there. You're just going to have to stand up. Okay, so see if we can get rid of Tackle Boy. 
Push you to there. Okay. Now, we kind of need to break that a bit up a bit. Great stuff. Now, you get into that tackle zone. Oh, another KO, please. Yes. Another one bites the dust. There are only zombies, but they all count. Um, is that a two die block now? Yes. And where do I want to pop you? I'll pop you to there. Oh, there goes another one. Stun, maybe? Yep. Okay. So. I'm going to put you around there so we've got a bit of guard. Put you into there. And now I've got a zombie here. Who is going to step into there? Okay. Helped out by knocking out those zombies, I think. So, clearly he's not going anywhere anytime soon. He might one by block to get in on the tackle zone. Right, who's hit me there? The mummy. Right, where do I want to go that's most annoying? I reckon it's there. We don't want to free up any of these players. I want to make this is hard. The only good block he's got is this one die here. And even if he does get in, if he doesn't hurt my zombie, I've got the chance to put him right back where he is. And with guard here, if he doesn't dodge these out, I'm going to have two free shots and some very lightweight ghouls. Key is I just didn't want them to be able to be able to get a two die block in on the ghoul. Might decide to one die him. But either way, I'm making sure that there's some difficult decisions to be made. Two die over here, obviously. Oh, he's gone for the dodge. Now he's got a two die on him. So for good for guard to work, we've got to hope that he doesn't roll well. <laughs> Which he did. So, right, this is important. Where would be the most awkward spot? I think it's here. We don't want him being removed though. He's not removed, that's fine. We shall stand firm. All these guys are getting up again in a minute. He could dodge out and get a one die on the ball carrier, but he could make a two die with a cheeky one die block here that goes his way. He's got to take the one die because at some point, because he's not dodging out there. Um, and if he doesn't do anything, there's a good chance that white's getting surfed. So I've got to expect the one die to come. And now, if he dodges, he'll get a two die. Which, you know, to be fair, it's unlikely we're going down with Blodge. Now, if I go there, it does give him a chance to have a pop, doesn't it? And it would be a, it would be a two die up. No, I think I've got to go there for safety reasons. <laughs> See, there we go. If he doesn't damage this too much... Oh, he's gone for a re-roll. Oh, he's done it on the werewolf. Right. Interesting.
<laughs> he's tried to dodge it. I don't blame him for trying it. Right. Okay. So first of all, let's get any players on the floor up easily. I won't be blitzing with you. Okay. So this is two die blocks all day long, isn't it? Yeah, so we'll do that next. Down he goes. And amazingly, doesn't kill him. Um... T3. Let's go into there. Okay. See, these ghouls could bounce out quite easily, couldn't they? So let's see what happens when I 2 die block him. I just knew that was going to happen. Thank you. Uh, do I want to follow? Yes, I do, because I want this to be a two die when the werewolf has a go. Let's send you through to there. Now we want to make this hard, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, we'll do that then. So here's the blitz. Oh my goodness me. <laughs> Off goes Tackle Mighty Blow. Oh. Is it even a knockout? No. But then we can get to... Now do we want to be there or there? We want to be there, don't we? Right, and then the zombie can go around to here. So we've got a two die block there. Right, now what do we do here? I think we might try and dodge away. Let's see if we can get him away. We're not going to waste a reroll on it though. Although he's now stunned. <laughs> There's just no good dodges to be had now for him. And we've got all four of the ghouls all nicely contained. We have left a few players um, vulnerable. Oh, there we go, starting to even up the odds now. We'll stand firm. Good boy. Oh. Where do we want to... Yeah. <laughs> that was actually a misclick, but that's as good a place, isn't it? So what dodges did he have to roll then to get out of there? Two four plus dodges. Did need, did need the dodge skill though. Good. It's about time someone failed. 
Right, stunned as well. Brilliant. Okay, so we want you up. We want you to there. Use the werewolf on him. And where can we get you? Not where I want you to be. Oh. Hang on, can you get round? One, two. Yeah, you can. Alright. So I'll go with this. Got to take any opportunity to kill ghouls. Uh, now we'll put you there. Now, can I get you round to there? I can. And that means I'll get my two die back on him. Pop you down there. And stay put. Good. Good. That's brilliant. Right, which means we can now blitz you. Which probably won't take him down because we need a pow. We didn't get it, but we did get you off the ball. And we can pop you to there. I think we're giving them too much time to score if we go now. Uh, right, zombie. Where do I want zombie? I think I'm actually going to leave him there. Right, where's the ghoul? Can he get to me? He can't really get there next turn. So we've got at least one turn to grace. So three not player players. You'd like to think they all won't get back. Right, we don't have to worry about that mummy now. And he's gone down, which is good. So that should buy us at least one more turn. So we'll get to there. Um, yeah, yeah, he's not getting there. Okay. Um, what next? So... go with that first. Oh! And our opponents conceded! We won! I think that was a bit early for that, but no permanent damage was caused. Still, we'll take a win. Uh, so, <laughs> so in terms of team building, I had a zombie get for SPP. It's my own fault for stalling, I guess. Um, so yeah, not much to say on that one. Um, we haven't even got enough to get the next battle pass. What a shame. Uh, let's go to the team. Uh, so, we've got... Oh, we're, get, we're getting quite expensive now. Um, I can't sack off Sammy Scarecrow, although it kind of makes sense to. Rick Walker. Let's give him a random general. Let's see what he can get. Because if it's awful, we can sack him off. Kick is brilliant. I'll have kick all day long for a random. Um, Caliban still isn't next and up to his stat up yet. He needs a Kaz. Um, he needs another MVP. Uh, do I really want 13 zombies? Right. Who's this? Roger. Sorry, Roger. How many games have you played, Roger? 12 matches and you've done absolutely nothing because you've got no SPP. Roger, it's not good enough. I'm afraid you are fired. 
now make sure I'm not deleting the entire team. This player, yeah. Sorry, Roger. Um, Simon Pegg. I could have got rid of you. Can't get rid of Simon Pegg, though, can you? Uh, right, I don't think there's anyone I need to buy. Because I don't... Because uh, I've just got rid of a player. So, let's do our expensive mistakes. Half the treasury is lost. Well, it's fine, because we've still got 205,000. Of course, I could lose a werewolf and a uh, flesh golem in the next game, and which would cost me more than that, but it's unlikely, given what we've had. Um, so, yeah, it's a win. We'll take that. Shame we didn't get further into the game. Um, but, and yeah, and I just felt like I was going to score that touchdown. But at the same time, you know, you'd have... Unless you're only playing for wins, you could have easily equalised in that. You only had uh, KOs, none of them were permanents. But anyway, sometimes people just had enough of it. And if it gives me the win, I'm not going to complain. Right, yeah. Well, thanks for joining for this short game. And I'll uh, see you on the next video. Thank you very much. Bye for now.